Hi, my name is Karin from Extraordinary Fitness and today we are going to work on something a little bit different, but we all need it. It's grip strength. Like I guess many of you who are doing pole or doing aerial, whatever, you will deal with having problems with your grip strength. And um, I have some exercises which I normally do, which I work on, or when I'm on holiday and I don't have a hoop or something with me, I can work on that instead. So let's start. Um, number one, if you have this, it's really easy to buy on Amazon or wherever. It's like one of these small uh, machines for grip. So you just press in and release, press in and release. So one thing I do is like, I do it really fast as much as I can until the hands just give up. So it's like press, 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 as fast as you can until your hands basically fall asleep or you can't press anymore. So this is one exercise. The other one is to press it in and hold it for uh, one minute or something to just press and hold it close the whole time, the entire time. Here you also can on some, like this one is obviously a little bit more advanced. You can even adjust the strength of the thing so you can make it harder or easier. So this one I can really recommend, you can have it in your bag or something and just when you have time, you use it and you train the grip strength in that way. Another exercise, which I really like, and unfortunately sometimes do too little, is this one. It's a small rubber band with five holes. One is a little bit bigger. You put your thumb in and then all your fingers together. And this one does the opposite. When this one was pinching your hand together, this one is opening your fingers. So you kind of try to open your fingers, push it open, and you will feel it's much harder than you think. And again, there's different strength rubber bands. So you can find the one which is good for you and then just hold it open, push your fingers open and work the other direction of your grip strength like this and close and open. And it will really work your fingers. Another one which I really like, we have the fingers, the hands, and we also have the wrists because what we don't think about is there's 30 muscles involved in our grip strength. So. You can imagine there's a lot to train. And another one I do, which is very good for strengthening your wrists because doing aerial or climbing, it's a lot of force on them. So using a dumbbell, you have to adjust the straight, the weight. This one is four kilo. I normally do it with eight kilos, but find your level. Don't do it too hard because it's your wrist. So be gentle to them. So having it with the weight on top and then just pushing it up and down. And when it's lighter, it's easier, but when it gets more heavy, it will start to move and you will have to all the time adjust your wrist and strengthen it by pushing it up and it will move around. I'm just showing you now so you see what it is about and keeping it straight upwards without moving too much and without dropping down. This is one I really like. Another one for your wrist would be like taking something, put it on a table or anywhere, take a a normal weight and then again find your weight often with wrist you don't need super heavy because it's a small part a small joint and then you just go down and up like this maybe 10 to 20 times even 30 then you turn your hand around and you do the same in the opposite way so this time you bend it up and to the middle up and to the middle up and to the middle turn it to the side and do the similar thing but up and down up and down. So work your wrist in all directions. Another one I like for your finger strength is that you take a weight platter, one or two. This is up to you. When it's two, it's much more hard because you have to push them together. And then you just take it into your fingers. You pinch kind of your fingers and you lift it up and down. So you can do it standing or like I'm going to go like this. So you pinch it up and down. And depending on the weight, of course, it gets more heavy because you have to pinch your fingers together. So this one as well, very useful, very helpful in training up your strength. The last one, if you have the possibility of a bar, some are hanging, is to hang, hang on time, just hang down. So with one arm or two, hang there and put your clock, your timer and hang as long as you can. This will as well strengthen your grip, of course. Yeah, so there is more advanced stuff. There is also like if you have in general a pain, which people say, take a bucket of rice, put your fist in and circle it around, it will strengthen it in a soft way. So depending on where you are, if you have like inflammation or something, I recommend that you start super soft, maybe with a bucket of rice, turning your wrist. And if you have kind of strong wrist or not pain, you can condition them and strengthen them and it will prevent you from getting pain. So good luck with it. And uh, thank you for watching this video. If you like my video, subscribe to my YouTube channel. Get weekly tutorials and tips on training, fitness and aerial stuff. Uh, you find me on social medias, extraordinary.fitness. 
and see you next Wednesday for new tutorials. Bye!